Are you looking for new and exciting ways to bond with your Shizu? Look no further. Playing games is one of the best ways to have fun and build a strong relationship with your pup. From fetch, tug of war, hide and seek, and chase the prey to agility training, there are so many different games you can play with your Shizu that will keep them entertained for hours on end. Not only do these activities provide physical exercise, but they also help strengthen their mental capabilities too. So grab a ball or toy and prepare for quality time spent playing with your furry friend. Number 1. Fetch a ball. Playing fetch with your Shizu can be fun to pass the time and bond with your pup. The training process for teaching your dog to fetch is relatively simple and takes only a few steps that you can easily do at home. First, you'll need to choose the perfect size toy or ball for your pup. A good rule of thumb is to use something small enough for your Shizu to carry but big enough that it won't be a choking hazard. Next, you'll want to get the ball or toy in front of your pup and start rolling it away from them. It's important here to keep your enthusiasm up and make sure your dog is paying attention. You can praise them and encourage the behavior as soon as they begin to chase it. Once they've picked up the toy or ball in their mouth, hold out your hand, tell them fetch, and reward them with a treat when they bring it back to you. With just a few repetitions, your pup will learn the basics of fetch. Keep practicing, and they'll be an expert fetchers in no time. So grab a ball or toy and get ready for fun fetching with your Shizu. Your pup will have a great time as you bond over this classic game. Number 2. Tug of War Playing a game of tug of war with your Shizu is an excellent way to get in some quality bonding time with your pup. This game is enjoyable for you and your dog as it stimulates physical activity and mental stimulation and encourages positive behavior. Before starting the game, pick up a good quality tug toy designed for your pup's size, as regular rope or fabric may be too rough on their paws. You can also opt for a braided cotton material to make the game more enjoyable. Once you have a suitable tug toy, it's time to start playing. Let your pup take one side of the tug toy in their mouth, and you take the other. Make sure to hold your side firmly but gently as you let your pup tug at it. Remember, the goal of this game is not to see who can win but to spend quality time with your pup so that they feel loved and secure. So go ahead and let them win. After all, who doesn't love a good victory for their fur buddy? Not only does this game provide physical and mental stimulation to your pup, but it also strengthens the bond between you two. So get out there and start tugging with your pup, they'll thank you for it. Number 3. Hide the treat or hide and seek. Hide the treat or hide and seek is a great way to give your Shizu a fun and stimulating activity. It encourages problem solving skills, promotes physical exercise, and satisfies their instinct to seek rewards. To play hide the treat, hide treats throughout your home or yard and then encourage your pup to sniff them out. Ensure the treats you use are appropriate for your dog's size, age, and nutritional requirements. To play hide and seek, have your pup sit while you hide in a different room of your house or outside. When they're ready, call their name and let them find you. It's sure to be an exciting game of hide and seek for you and your Shizu. Whatever game you choose, hide the treat or hide and seek will provide hours of fun and entertainment for you and your four-legged friend. Play on. Number 4. Chase the Prey. Chase the Prey is one of the most enjoyable activities with a Shizu. It is a great way to get your pup some much needed exercise and stimulation and provide you and your dog with plenty of fun. To play chase the prey with your Shizu, start by pretending you are the prey and running away from your pup. Make sure to keep things light and fun so as not to scare your dog. As you're running, encourage them to come after you with enthusiastic calls like come on, get me. This should get their attention, and they will start chasing after you. If your pup has difficulty catching you, try running in a zigzag or jumping over objects. Once they catch up to you, give them some praise and plenty of love. Chase the prey is a great way to bond with your Shizu and get them moving. It's also an activity that can be easily adjusted depending on their energy level and the size of your yard. So don't be afraid to let your pup give chase the prey a try. Who knows, it may become one of your pup's favorite activities. Number 5. Agility Training Agility training is a great way to bond with your Shizu and give them an outlet for their energy. You can set up an agility course in your home using everyday items like chairs, tables, and even pillows. Start by creating a course for your pup, and add a few twists and turns. Then, get your pup's attention by offering a treat or toy at the start of the course and cheer them on as they go. As your dog makes their way through the obstacle course, offer lots of praise and even a reward for completing the course successfully. You'll soon have an agility champ on your hands with practice and consistency. So get creative and have fun with your furry friend as you give them a challenge that will keep them fit and happy. 
We'd love to hear your thoughts on this video, so please comment below on which cat behaviors surprised you the most. And remember to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe for more, we'll see you at the next one.